famous couples always look fantastic in the spotlights. But the fairy tale often ends when the cameras turn off. Yet in all this mess, there are lucky celebs who manage to find their true love, despite the pressure of the lifestyle. These couples definitely have something to teach us about relationships. Check out the secrets for long-lasting happy marriages from the famous couples in our video. Kirk Douglas and Ann Bidens. Stay romantic. Kirk Douglas was a superstar in the 50s and 60s, world famous for his role in the film Spartacus. And during his stunning acting and producing career, Ann Bidens was standing next to him. They had ups and downs, but were absolutely desperate when their youngest son died because of intoxication in 2004. They've managed to survive this tragic loss only with each other's help. Kirk and Anne have been together for 63 years and still can't get enough of each other. Douglas and Bidens believe that staying romantic warms up the relationship. That is why they renewed their vows and hosted the great big wedding they've always wanted to have. Barbara Streisand and James Brolin. Being honest, James Brolin and Barbara Streisand have been married for 20 years. Barbara divorced from her first husband in 1971. She dated some other men later, but felt desperate to find love. She got used to her solitude by the time she met James. But it all changed when she married him at the age of 56, proving that it's never too late to find true love. They've both been previously married, and having learned through mistakes, are now sure that kindness and honesty stand behind a happy marriage. It's never too late to fall in love again and make things right. Keith Urban and Nicole Kidman Finding time for each other He is an Australian country singer, having released nine successful music albums. And she is a world-class Academy Award-winning actress, famous for her roles in the Moulin Rouge musical and the film The Hours. They both have been through a lot of struggles. Keith helped Nicole recover from her painful divorce from Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise's Scientology beliefs pressed on Nicole so hard that she was forced to leave him and share custody over their two adopted children until Nicole's children were banned from talking to her, calling her an enemy of the church. Meanwhile, Nicole managed to help Keith battle his alcohol abuse and drug addiction. Nicole pulled him out of his self-destruction and saved his life. After going through these nightmares, Keith and Nicole don't want to stay apart from each other for long. They say keeping in touch and seeing each other is what is most important for a healthy marriage. As Nicole told People in 2015, he flew 10 hours to come and be with me for the night. And then he flew back and did a gig. That for me is love in action. Hugh Jackman and Deborah Lee Furness. Love Beyond Age. Hugh Jackman has been married to Deborah Lee Furness, who is 13 years his senior for 21 years. They first met on set in 1995 and fell in love with each other right away. He married 41 year old Deborah Lee when he was 28. Because of her age, Deborah had trouble getting pregnant. After desperate efforts to have kids, they settled for adoption. Jackman praises his wife for committing to their family so that he could pursue his Hollywood career. He admits that he wouldn't have achieved success in his career if not for her support and dedication. Jackman and Furness's happy marriage is an example of love beyond age. Tom Hanks and Rita Wilson support each other. An acting veteran, Tom Hanks is famous for his roles as Forrest Gump and Captain John Miller in Saving Private Ryan. He and his wife Rita Wilson have been married for 30 years. He fell in love with Rita at first glance, and their feelings have never faded since then. Rita and Tom believe that support for each other's endeavors makes their relationship stronger. Tom Hanks is sure that marriage shouldn't be burdensome. Even though they had to go through hard times when Rita was diagnosed with breast cancer, Rita was pleasantly surprised with how caring Tom was around her. He canceled all his work and stayed with Rita at home, laughing and crying, watching movies together on the sofa. It seems that difficulties only bring this couple closer. 
Faith Hill and Tim McGraw. Being tolerant. Country stars Faith Hill and Tim McGraw are not only a duet on the stage, but a happy real life duet married for more than two decades. Through all these years, they've learned that tolerance is the most important part of a relationship. The couple finds time to argue and discuss their problems, but they always remain tolerant. They admit they are not the easiest people to live with, but their love and mutual respect help them cope with stubbornness and hot temper. The ability to listen and find compromises helped them save their marriage all these years. Meryl Streep and Don Gummer, being kind. Oscar-winning actress Meryl Streep and her husband Don Gummer have been holding each other's hands for 40 years. But before they met, Meryl almost lost the spirit of passion. She was devastated by the tragic death of her sweetheart, John Cazale, whom she was going to marry. Meeting Dawn was a rescue for her, giving a second chance to fall in love again. After so many years together, Meryl says that the key to a happy, long-loving relationship is goodwill and willingness to bend. It is important to step back to your partner sometimes. Meryl says, I once read that in any good marriage, one partner is the gardener and the other is the garden. We take it in turns to be either. Taking turns caring for each other, Meryl and Don found a way to keep the relationship strong for so long. First, I'm going to thank Don, because when you thank your husband at the end of the speech, they play him out with the music, and I want him to know that everything I value most in our lives, you've given me. Barack Obama and Michelle Obama, being best friends. Behind every successful man, there is a woman. And the Obama family proved that during 26 years of great marriage. Barack couldn't hold his tears back thanking his wife during his presidential speech. He said that through all these years, Michelle has been his best friend. Michelle and Barack Obama believe that politics shouldn't bring seriousness into a relationship. Laughter and a good sense of humor help them go through all of life's storms. It helps them remain best friends for such a long time. So, do you agree with these rules for a happy marriage? Which one do you think is the most useful? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Click on the OSA icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel.